She is a hockey superstar in this country, and so it makes perfect sense that Haley Wickenheiser is going to carry the Canadian flag at the Olympics. She's played for Canada at four Olympics, capturing three gold and one silver medal, and she says she's honored to lead the team this time. But as Vashi Capellos reports, other Canadians are a bit edgy about security in Sochi. The one who will lead our team. Well, that would be hockey player Haley Wickenheiser. The four-time Olympian will carry Canada's flag in Sochi at the opening ceremonies. I kind of thought it was a joke when Steve called. Just really proud and grateful for the, for the chance. Also proud is Wickenheiser's son Noah. His mom is training in Europe, so he accepted the flag on her behalf. Come on, like that's like pretty much like the coolest thing you could do ever. It wasn't hard for us to choose Haley. She was, she's a fantastic candidate. Now, while there is certainly a ton of excitement surrounding this aspect of the Olympics, thanks to terrorist threats, there is also a lot of concern for the safety of both athletes and their families attending the games. Terrorist attacks in other areas of Russia have the world on heightened alert. The latest threat has police in Sochi posting flyers looking for a black widow. Roberto Luongo says security concerns are one reason his family won't be coming with him to the games. It's definitely on my mind, uh, I'm not going to lie, you know, uh, I think we're all a little bit concerned. Speed skater Danielle Wotherspoon's family decided to make the trip, but security is a worry. We thought, well, maybe we should stay away from some of the public transportation. I don't know. Maybe we'll walk everywhere. The federal government maintains a plan is in place. We're working with everyone, local authorities, you know, other uh, nations who are like-minded. Canadian Olympic Committee President Marcel Obu says a crisis committee has been formed. It's the same one that worked on the London Games. We are rehearsing. We did last night, and we are rehearsing the worst. And we are prepared. Words meant to reassure athletes and their families who are surely hoping the worst doesn't happen. Vashi Capellos, Global News, Ottawa.